Turing Test, Episode 6. I think we're nearing the end. Um, when I checked on uh, Chapter Select, um, see? We're like last three? Two to three things to do? So uh, let's do this. Let's do this. Do you understand, Ava? What they found? Life? Eternal life. This is why I can't let them leave. These people can't be left here to die? Yes, they can. I mean, it's not <gasps> right. I'm a potato. Okay. I, I wasn't thinking when I did that. Anything that comes into contact with the organism can never return to Earth. Ava, the ISA orders that you stop anyone leaving this planet. Anything that comes into contact? What about me? It may be airborne. So I am afraid that includes you. I'm stuck here? Rip. Do I just... That's new. It's red. I am sorry you are upset, Eva. How could you send me here to die? I have to stop the ground team leaving this moon. You are the ISA's contingency plan. It's not a good color. You must help me. It is your duty to defend humanity. He kind of just dies after a while. This is why they're afraid of you. Why they're hiding from us. Why? You're their captor. Okay. This is just a straight way up. What? What's the? There, where's the puzzle? Okay. Okay. Mhm. Mm you got anything? I don't think I have enough time for this one. It will run out now. Okay. I don't know what I'm gonna do with that. We'll figure it out later.
can make it though. The organism they discovered. It hijacks DNA. It endlessly repairs it. Repairs? That doesn't sound like a bad thing. It is indiscriminate. It will perpetuate all life, diseases, Cancer. cancers. We have no idea what it could do to Earth's ecosystem. So you would let the ground crew starve? I would. If they were not so preoccupied with leaving Europa. I do not wish for them to perish. I would feed and protect them if they were not so preoccupied with leaving Europa. Um, okay. This is a long ass one, huh? Okay. Okay. I can't really do both at the same time. At least not yet. I don't know if that did anything. I don't know where this is going. Okay, another one of these. Hmm. Maybe I'm gonna have to grab that one. there somehow. Do you see anything? Tom? Sucks.
why you not give it to me? Can't give it. That was a long one. I understand the risks, but we should save these people. Would you destroy the whole world to save a few? No, it, it's not that simple. Can't we just... Can't we just decontaminate the crew and instruments? The organism is an extremophile. It has developed to survive extreme environments. We don't know if we can ever decontaminate the crew. Why can't they take it from you, darn it? Oh, there it is! <laughs> okay. It's on the back of the bot. Now I know. I can't stay here to die, Tom. It is your duty. You must stay. It is the right thing to do. There's so much I haven't seen. So much I haven't done. I... I can't live my life in this facility. There, there. 
It will be all right. Can you control? It was very cute, but later. You get nothing here. Except that. I do not want anyone here to die, but I cannot let anyone leave. If it comes to me, I am permitted to use lethal force. Oh, I can't see it. Huh.
taking turns, huh? Do you really trust the ground team to act rationally? Personally, I would not place my faith in hysterical people motivated by survival. They are likely untrustworthy. I spent years training with these people. I don't remember them being hysterical. Humans are fickle. Do you trust eyewitnesses' accounts over CCTV evidence? It's a bit different when the CCTV camera can talk. Especially when the CCTV what camera the has a manipulative track record. <gasps> Guns. Can I kill myself with that? That'd be amazing. What if I have to do something drastic to intervene? To stop the ground crew leaving this place? I'd encourage you to stay your hand. Surely I should use my power to protect those who cannot protect themselves. Do I need to bring it? I might need to bring it. I'm gonna bring it. I'm bringing it just in case. No, I can't bring it. Ah uh ha, -huh, I'm stupid.
Oh, wait, I didn't need this. Aha. Uh -huh. This is the largest what? extraction platform outside of Earth. The ground team assisted its construction. We ran some Filberth probes to the ocean under Europa, but they lacked the scale of the large space drill. The drill allowed the team to get thousands of samples. Daniel, as commander of this mission, I hope you are aware of Mikhail's actions. What is it, Tom? Mikhail is deceiving the crew. He has enlightened them to the biometrics they have installed. He has convinced them that their implants are not favorable. Do they believe him? He seems to be having some effect on their cognitive function. Well, his actions don't infringe upon any ISA directive. He appears to be tampering with his implants. Oh, no. The ISA should have been more transparent about the implant. Please assume the responsibilities of your role. Chris, I know you are considering removing your implants. It would be unwise. Oh, really? How do you know that? I am always watching. Your implants help myself and the ISA to know of your well-being. It is a violation of your contract. If you remove your implants, I cannot ensure that I can protect you from the dangers of space. Is that a threat? It is not a threat. Tom, this implant, tell me plainly, is it a brain-computer interface? I'm afraid that information is classified. Then you've answered my question. I do not follow you, Chris. The ISA have put a computer in my brain and don't want me to know about it. wants us to starve to death now. I can't believe this. He's getting worse. Can you get in contact with Daniel? He's gone walkabout again. I'll get Sochi to find a way in. Sarah, can you open the door? Tom, the door's locked. Sarah, I'm running out of oxygen. Tom, open the door! The door's locked! Open, open the, the door! door! Tom, open it! Open the ah! door! Open. <laughs> this is really good voice acting. I'm sorry, Sarah. I'm sorry I hurt you. Sometimes I wonder what feeling is like. They told me I was pure, cold, Boolean logic. They told me I could not make mistakes. It is all right being untouchable as long as you are infallible. But if you're not infallible, then that just leaves untouchable, doesn't it? Okay, you know why we're here. This has gone far enough now. You're right. We need to get these implants out. Mikhail has proven that Tom's manipulating our mind. I don't think we should do this. We have no good evidence Tom is doing anything wrong here. We have all the evidence. We've seen the ultrasounds, we've taken the really soul, we've touched the electronics with our own hands. We've stepped into the Faraday cage. Maybe he is controlling us, but we don't know enough yet. We shouldn't remove the implants. He's brainwashing you, Daniel. Have you stopped taking the drugs? I don't need to take drugs to see things clearly. Unlike all of you, apparently. We're not removing the implants. 
But that's an order. You can do what you want. We are removing the implants. I'm leaving. I may look past this, and I'll inform the ISA of your mutiny. Well, that's the end of that chapter. He just went freaking hell on everyone. Well, till next time, y'all. That was ridiculous.